All right, I think we're live. If folks are, are live with me, just uh, say yes or no in the comment section so I know you, you've joined live with me. I think a few people have joined. So if you can just say a you know hello on the on the chat, then I know that you've you've joined live with me. Hey Sridhar. Hey, how are you? I'm good, I'm good. How where, where are you logging in from? Hey Midun, hey Anand. Hey, Avi. Hey, Ritika. Hey, guys. Hey, Vansh. Hey, Priyansh. Hey, Ashok. Okay, great. So, Shil's first statement has been data structure. Okay. <laughs> hey, Kiran. I'm good. How are you? Oh, Sridhar, you're from Bangalore as well. Awesome. I'm from Bangalore as well. Uh, I've lived here for more than 20 years. Hey, Tarun. Hey, Midun. Hey, guys. Awesome. I think we've got a lot of people. Maybe if you guys can, you know, just put in the comment section, where are you from? Like, you know, where are you logging in from? Which city are you currently in? If you can just put it in the comments. Okay, I'm not getting any responses on the comments, but uh, maybe there's a lag. But I'm essentially saying, uh, okay, now it's coming now. Okay, Kerala, Panipat, Tarun's from Hyderabad, someone's from Ranchi, someone from Indore, Mirat, Jammu, Dehradun, wow, from all over the place. Bareilly, awesome, awesome. It's great to see so much. So much diversity and you guys are logging in from all over India. Yes, Pankaj, long time. Long time no see. <laughs> I can't read this. Kasia, Kasia Kaput Kanpati. Okay, sorry, that's a tongue twister for me. Oh, someone's from the US as well. Hey. Hi Gina. Thank you for logging in. Allahabad, Kerala. Wow, awesome. And if you guys can help me understand, you know, are you working professionals right now or are you college students? If you can just put it again in the comment section so I know and I can and I can, you know, talk about the most relevant things. Are you college students or are you working professionals? Yes, yeah, sure, I, I can help you for sure. Um, either on this call or, you know, feel free to, to send me a message on LinkedIn and happy to help. Okay, student, uh, Priya says she's a student, Vikas, college student. Okay, college student, a lot of college students today. Okay, you okay, know, plenty of working professionals as well, I think. Okay, Arvind is a working professional, Webhouse is a working professional. Varun's also a working professional, working in Sapient. Okay, nice. Working as a React.js developer is Kiran. Okay. Sagar saying that he's from Bombay and he's been in the tech industry for the last five years. Wow, that's a long time. Gina saying she's an entertainment solutions advisor for Forest and Corp. Oh, okay, nice. Awesome. So I think uh, then we have a lot of, of, you know, very good mix of both college students and working professionals, which is super exciting. 
um, because what I'm going to talk to you guys about today is relevant for both of you, uh, for both people in their first, second, third year of college, or if you're a working professional with any number of years of experience, um, this session is very, very relevant to you. Um, essentially, I'm going to be talking about, you know, Scalar does live uh, free classes every weekend. And, um, you know, I just wanted to use this time to help you guys understand what are we doing this weekend? Uh, we get a lot of questions about what we do and we thought it would just be a good thing to, you know, go live once in a week to just help you understand what are the live sessions, the free sessions that we are conducting this weekend, which is tomorrow and the day after that. Um, yeah, Shankar, we're, we're, we've started now. Um, so uh, so that's, that's essentially the agenda of, of the next 30 minutes uh, that I would love for, to talk to you guys for. Uh, quick introduction of myself. I'm just going to put up a banner here. Uh, my name is Vedant. Uh, I am one of the heads of Scalar Academy, which is our product that we you know, hopefully use to accelerate the careers of working professionals. Uh, we have been in existence since uh, last year, so we're two years old in this.
Hey, so sorry guys. Uh, I had a random internet outage. Is everyone still here with me live? If you are live with me, uh, just put a yes or no in the comments and, and really, really sorry about that. Uh, it was an internet outage on my end. Just put a yes or no if you're still with me. OK, great. Awesome, awesome, great. Uh, I think a bunch of you are still with me. Great, so uh, again, so sorry. Um, I had an internet outage, uh, and that's why you would have seen a black screen for some time. Um, but thank you for, for still staying on the live stream. So I was just introducing myself um, before I blanked out. My name is Vedant. I am one of the heads of Scalar Academy, which is our product to upskill um, working professionals. We also have another product called Scalar Edge, which is a product that is used to uh, upskill college students. Uh, and our overall philosophy is that we try to make world-class engineers. Um, that's a quick introduction about me. Today, I'm going to be talking about really, really quickly about the two free classes that we have planned for this weekend. Uh, the first one is an HLD masterclass that one of our co-founders will be taking. Uh, before that, before I reveal uh, what the class is all about, uh, how many of you guys have heard of Anshuman, who is one of the co-founders of uh, Scalar? Just put a yes or no in the comments. I'll know that, and then you know I can talk a little more about Anshuman, or I'll just keep it very brief. But just let me know on a yes or no if you have heard of uh, Anshuman in the past. I'm hearing Devanshu saying Harshit. Okay, Krishna saying yes, Omkar saying yes, Vishal said yes as well. Okay, Amrullah said no. Okay, Isha said no as well, got it. So maybe then I'll, I'll do a quick uh, introduction about Anshuman as well because Anshuman will be uh, the instructor for the free masterclass that we are doing uh, on this weekend. Uh, so Anshuman essentially, as I mentioned right now, he's one of the co-founders of Scalar. Uh, and earlier, he was one of the co-founders of Interviewit. Um, he is actually an, uh, he was a team lead at Facebook. And obviously, I'm sure all of you have heard of Facebook. Um, and he worked directly with Mark Zuckerberg to create the Facebook Messenger app. So he was, he joined Facebook way back when it was a, a really small company, way back in 2010. Uh, he was one of the early employees to join. He w went to Menlo Park and, as I mentioned, worked directly with Mark Zuckerberg uh, to create the Facebook Messenger product that you guys all use today. Now, post that, he was actually one of the landing team members in Facebook's London office, which is essentially Facebook's first office outside of the United States. And when he was there, he actually um, tried to hire uh, Facebook's engineering team in London, and he realized firsthand, uh, you know, how difficult it was to hire high-quality engineers. So that's a very, very short brief of Anshuman. But if you guys want to know more about him, you should definitely check out his LinkedIn profile. All the details uh, are present over there. Um, and then post that, as I mentioned, he started Interviewbit. And again, maybe just taking a quick check, how many of you guys have used Interviewbit in the past? or use it currently right now? Uh, just give me a yes or no if you've used Interviewbit or are currently using Interviewbit. Just a yes or no in the comments would be very helpful. Okay, Pankaj has used Interviewbit in the past or is using it right now. Just waiting for more inputs to come in. Okay, Amrullah saying he's used it as well. Yeah, just put a yes or no. Uh, Vanjay is saying that he's not used it, okay? Uh, Harshada saying that she has used it, okay? Vanjay, if you should definitely check out Interviewbit, it's interviewbit.com. 
Um, it's a site where essentially you can practice previous interview questions in case you're, you're preparing for uh, a product-based interview coming up in the future. You can definitely use the interview with platforms completely free of cost, um, and you can use it to practice for your next interview. Okay, Isha is saying that she's heard it, but she's never used it. Definitely, Isha, you should check it out uh, maybe right after this live session. Um, so this is a little about Anshuman. Um, and the HLD masterclass that we will be doing, let me talk to you guys uh, a little about that, which is essentially this. Um, the topic of this masterclass is essentially, if you can see my screen right now, is how a website running on one laptop scale to become a unicorn. Um, now, essentially, these are this masterclass will be for three hours. It will be on this Saturday from 7 p.m. to 10 p.m. Um, and maybe before I get into the exact specifics of the masterclass, um, again, you know, help me understand again, guys, yes or no, if you're comfortable with HLD uh, as of today. Just give me a yes or no if you're comfortable with HLD. Just waiting for a few responses to come in. Are you comfortable with HLD concepts? I mean, I don't know if I have an internet glitch. Okay, so is saying no. Imanshu is saying no. Shivansh is saying yes. Siddhika is saying yes. Okay. I'm not saying somewhat. Okay. So this masterclass essentially is for all of you who you know uh, maybe think you know a, a lot about HLD. Maybe you should attend this masterclass to really test yourself and your HLD concepts. The ones who are saying, "Hey, I don't know HLD," or maybe I know it somewhat, I'm not too sure. This is definitely something that you should attend. Um, as I mentioned, it's a three-hour live session with Anshuman, uh, who, by the way, has scaled Facebook Messenger. So. You know, as you understand, HLD is essentially HLD concepts help you understand how do you build scalable systems, right? Building Swiggy for a hundred users is very, very different from building Swiggy for ten million users. And HLD concepts is essentially something that will help you bridge that gap, help you understand how do you build really, really scalable systems. So let's talk a little about what the masterclass will 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 sort of entail, right? So Anshuman will take this over three hours. Uh, the first 30 minutes or so, I mean, just flash uh, my, my banner right now, but the first 30 minutes of this three hour live session, live masterclass will essentially be about Anshuman picking up one case study. And that, by the way, is how we do most things at Scalar, Scalar Academy, Scalar Edge, is that we always try to do a, a very real life example. We try to pick up a real life example and then teach with that. So there was this company called Delicious. Uh, I don't know how many of you have uh, have heard of this company. Maybe just put a, a yes or no if you've heard about Delicious. It was a, a bookmarking platform that was started in 2006. But have you heard of it in the past? Yes, no? Give me a yes or no if you've heard of this bookmarking platform called Delicious, because he's essentially going to sort of talk through uh, about this uh, th this particular product um, and how it basically scaled from one laptop in a dorm room uh, to being finally bought by fifty million dollars by Yahoo and then scaling to to become much much larger than that. Okay, I'm not saying no. Isha saying no as well. Okay. So essentially, guys, he is going to take the first 30 minutes to talk to you guys about this product called Delicious and talk to you about the architecture behind this company. As I mentioned, it was a bookmarking platform where essentially I'm browsing the web. I need to bookmark a page. I will bookmark it in this particular software because at that point of time in 2006, you couldn't really you know, move your bookmarks or you know, see your bookmarks across browsers, across platforms. You had to use Delicious for that. So the first 30 minutes, he's going to talk about the product, the architecture itself. Uh, the next 30 minutes, he's going to talk about load balancers. Uh, and why is that important? What is the concept? Uh, so on and so forth. And the next 60 minutes post that, he's going to talk about load balancing 
in Delicious's context, where he'll talk about concepts like data sharding included. Um, and this is actually a, a part which will be very, very interesting for many of you where you know he will be using a very interesting concept that will be used in almost all distributed databases. And so it's very important for you know folks who want to improve their HLT concepts. Uh, this part right here, the 60 minutes where he talks about load balancing in Delicious's context, talks about distributed databases, data sharding, et cetera, uh, will be very interesting for those of you who are interested in HLD. And the last 30 to 45 minutes, he will sort of solve all your doubts that you would have in that particular masterclass. Um, so as many of you might have you know, attended some of Scalar's masterclasses, free masterclasses that we do every weekend, and you will sort of be able to understand that, hey, we do things in a very, very interactive fashion. It's not just that Anshuman will come in and then just go on a monologue for three hours, but he will post problems in the masterclass. He will say a problem. He will wait for your inputs. You can always type and chat with him. Uh, you know, we do this over Zoom or we do it on our internal learning platform and you can chat with him. You can understand, you know, you can present your solution. He will respond to that saying, hey, this is correct. This is wrong. And he makes it very, very interactive. Um, so, you know, through the masterclass, it will be interactive and the last 30 to 45 minutes will be just dedicated to just doubt resolution. You know, whatever questions you guys have about delicious, about HLD concepts, about data sharding, distributed databases, all of that is what Anshuman will explain in a great, great amount of detail. Um, so essentially, let me just take a, a recap again. I'm basically talking about for everyone who just joined in right now, but I'm talking about an HLD masterclass. Uh, it's a free masterclass that Scalar is doing this weekend. Uh, let me just scroll up so you guys can see the date and the time as well. But essentially, it's happening this Saturday, uh, which is the 21st of November, which is tomorrow, from 7 p.m. to 10 p.m. Um, and this is going to be taken by Anshuman Singh, who is one of the co-founders of Scalar. Um, so everyone who is interested in HLD, whether you guys you know, think you know it or you think, you hey, I don't know it, I need to start from scratch. This is definitely something that is, is relevant for everyone who wants to start learning HLD from scratch. Uh, one caveat here, that this masterclass is only relevant for working professionals. Um, so if you're a working professional interested in HLD, you should definitely uh, sign up for this. Now, I know a lot of you in the past have asked that, hey, you know, why don't we do, uh, you know, more free events for everyone, right? College students, working professionals, and so on. And so the second thing that I'd like to talk to you guys about is the second, uh, you know, uh, masterclass, or as we call it, Employer Connect, uh, that we are doing again this weekend, this time on Sunday. Um, this one is going to be taken, this is essentially a webinar. This is taken by the ex-CTO of Grofers where he was going to be talking to you guys about how do you get noticed by top product-based tech companies. So maybe before I continue any longer, just tell me in the comment section, how many of you have used Grofers in the past? Just give me a yes or no if you've used Grofers. Okay, Anula saying that database sharding has cost me at least two interviews that I can remember, okay. Abdullah, then I, I really hope to see you in the masterclass on Saturday with Anshuman. Um, but I'd love to understand now with the question that I just posed that how many of you have, have used Grofers? I'm just going to flash that question on my screen. Okay, Balram saying he's not used Grofers. Grofers, Big Basket, any of these platforms that deliver groceries, fresh produce to you. Okay, Manikanth is saying yes, he has. Selyam is saying no, he's not heard of. Yash is saying no, he's not heard of Grofers. Okay, Amrula is saying no, he's not, but he's used Big Basket. Yeah, so if you guys have used Big Basket or you've used Grofers, uh, very, very similar in nature um, in that they essentially help deliver grocery items uh, to your doorstep. You don't have to move out at all. Uh, very, very convenient, especially in these times of COVID. Um, so Jacob is was actually the CTO of Grofers. Uh, let me just quickly walk you guys through his profile as well. You can check it out on LinkedIn, but he was the CTO of Grofers for three years um, and, and left very, very recently where, you know, 
he scaled the business from 40 million dollars which is about 300 crores um of 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 gmv as they call it uh to about 4000 crores of gmv within two and a half years uh, which is massive which is more than a 10x growth within two and a half years and so he really understands how do you build scalable tech products what does it take to be a rock star engineer and be hired by one of the top tech uh, sort of top product based tech companies and so he will be taking this webinar or this employer connect series where he will be answering all your questions on what does it take to get noticed by a top product based tech company so he will talk to you guys about his personal journey it's actually very very interesting um, he was you know uh, he's indian his mother is half indian um was born in the us you know hustled his way through and learned you know computer science uh, made websites for small ngos in the beginning moved back to india again really self taught his way through uh, you know computer science education and then became uh, you know uh, the cto of of grofers which is a very very big company it's a very very big deal um it's a very interesting uh, webinar i would highly encourage you guys uh, to attend um he will you know the very interesting insights that you know jacob and i were talking about where he was saying hey i want to tell everyone what is the importance of structured thinking and writing uh, for an engineer you won't believe it but you know his insight is that the best principal engineers that he knows you know take it a google uh, facebook amazon are often times the best writers and so there's a very clear correlation between writing and coding um you know that's one insight and he you know he can answer more questions around that uh, he'll also talk about you know what does it take to get noticed by a top product based tech company you know what are they looking for a lot of you are maybe working professionals who are in a service based company you know we get a lot of queries that hey i have 3 years 2 years 4 years of experience in a service based company and i'm not entirely sure how to crack this product based company i think i'll just get rejected on the back of my resume so jacob will talk about hey how do you ensure that that does not become a problem for you how do you ensure that you still get through to the interview round and you have a shot at cracking the product based tech company um you know what is the importance of hustle when you are an engineer especially in the early years of your career um so these are all the very interesting topics that that jacob will talk about in his webinar this one is actually happening on sunday uh, let me just flash this out for you so that you you're um you're clear about it so this one is how do you get noticed by top product based tech companies and this will happen uh, or this will be taken by the ex CTO of Grofers and this uh, webinar again by the way guys this is completely free these are free classes master classes that we do every weekend for everyone uh, this one is is you know open for whether you're a working professional or a college student it is open to everyone please do register i highly recommend this uh, just for you to understand the mindset that a CTO has and what does it take to actually chart that path out Uh, let me just quickly take you guys through you know what are the couple of things that you guys can you know expect to learn from this employer connect series or this particular master class essentially i'm just going to read it out once but you can check it out on the event page which is what are product based companies like grofers really looking for in engineers how should you prepare yourself to crack these companies so what are they looking for what are the skills they're looking for how do i hustle my way to get myself noticed um what are the skill sets that i need not just to crack an interview but you know what are the skill sets that i need to be a great engineer right a lot of the times we get questions that you know what do i need to learn how do i need to chart my career and so that's something that jacob will talk about as well along with skill sets it's very important to have the right mindsets and so what are the right mindsets that i should have as an engineer to really scale up this ladder and you know one day become maybe a a cto or a or a ctpo in the future um and how does he continuously keep himself updated what books does he read what thought leaders does he follow and what should you guys follow 
uh, as early engineers and yourself, either you're in your second, third year of engineering, or you're a working professional with any years of experience, what should you be really learning on a day-to-day -day basis uh, so that you have you know, the best and the brightest career ahead? So that's a little about you know, what this master or this weekend will be all about. Uh, there is a master class on Saturday on HLD, and there is you know, a webinar, a free webinar on Sunday, which is going to be taken by the ex-CTO of Grofers. Uh, I think we're right on time right now. It was a 30-minute live session. Again, I'm really sorry about the internet outage in between, but thank you so much for joining, and I really, really hope to see all of you uh, on uh, you know this weekend's masterclass and this weekend's discussion and talk with with Jacob. Uh, thank you guys. Take a great have a great evening, and I will see you guys very very soon. Thank you.